Everyone, I just realized that I was on intermission instead of starting. So. <laughs> hello, Mary. Hello, hello. Thank you for continuing your duties as a member of the gentry. Eleven months, almost a year, Mary. Oh, isn't that wonderful? So yes, hello Cake, hello Malu, congratulations on question mark being the first to arrive. Hello Alpha, hello Killy, and of course, hello Mary. <laughs> People have been calling me God for short for, for like the past two days now. It's been a bit odd. <laughs> So yes, today we are returning to Hideo Kojima's Wild Ride. Last time we were on Metal Gear Solid 2, we were... Well, we got to the beginning of Act 3, and I was a little bit perturbed. Hello, Connor. Uh, Confits. Hello, Confits. God's supremacy. <laughs> well, well, I do believe in an Abrahamic faith, so I guess, I guess? Question mark. <laughs> That's not inaccurate. <laughs> Silly Mary. <laughs> ah, cough. 
Da 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 da. Okay, so, 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 so. Let us get to the game. Main screen. What happened last time you went here? Uh, well, basically, what happened last time was uh. Uh. -uh. Why is it not? Scuff, Ellie, scuff. It's lucky. Ellie, scuff is lucky. So, what happened last time, if I remember correctly... Oh, thank you for following, Connor! Now, if you'll all notice, you all probably have noticed at this point, but I have upgraded the setup a little bit with actual sound effects. Oh, there we go. <clears throat> so, what happened last time was uh, the... Well, the president was murdered, and then we fought... To... No, that was uh, at the end of the last one. Uh, okay, so what happened was we found Otacon's sister, who was one of the main scientists on the baddies project, and we got her all the way to where she needed to be, only for Vamp to come back to life and murder her. And it was very sad. And also, apparently, uh, the, uh, Emmerich family had some severe, let's say, let's say Habsburgian issues, don't, why, why don't we? <laughs> and, uh, so after that happened, uh, turns out what she was needed for completely failed anyways, so it didn't even matter. She was literally just there to make Otacon sad. And me sad. And then, uh, Raiden was kidnapped by the baddies. And it was revealed that uh, the main antagonist, Solid Snake, who is Solid Snake's brother, oh, by the way, complete and utter plot twist, uh, Iroquois Pliskin is also Solid Snake. Oh, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. There we go. That was odd. Uh, what was I saying again? Uh, I was distracted by a little bit of scuff. A little tiny bit of scuff. There we go. Now it's now it's fit in the screen. Uh, so yes, uh, Raiden was apparently a child soldier in Liberia who was raised by Solidus as a child soldier in Liberia. And, uh, he apparently was so traumatized by that experience, quite reasonable, uh, I do believe, that uh, he completely suppressed those memories, and uh, being reminded of all that was very traumatic for both Dear Jack and I. <laughs> and then Rose got all mad at him for not telling her, because he was traumatized and suppressed the memory. So yes, plot twist! Raiden is actually a child soldier and Solid is his son. Oh, also, he's naked now. Because. why not? Hmm. <laughs> the reason is because Kojima is a. <laughs> the reason is because he's bisexual. That's the one reason. Okay, so now I have to get our stuff back. Arsenal gear, Jeju Nam. Hello, Glitchy! Raiden, do you copy? I you copy. Continue your m mission. Oh. I've lost all my gear. I need to locate Snake. He was never factored into the simulation. Leave him out of this. I can't do much naked, especially in this temperature. That's true. You won't be able to attack or enter the hanging mode either. I think Snake oh, has no. my gear. Raiden, take out Solidus and his men. You must recover Arsenal intact. Colonel, are you under orders from the Patriots? Your role, that is, mission, is to infiltrate the structure and disarm the terrorists. My role? Why do you keep saying that? Why not? This is a type of role-playing game. The point is what? that you play out your part, and I expect you to turn in a perfect performance. Colonel, I 
just remembered something. Channel, you're being what? weird. And I've never met you in person. Not once. Hmm. Complete your mission according to the simulation. Colonel, who are you? No more questions. We have Rosemary. What do you uh, mean no. that? Over and out. Oh no! Yeah, the mind screw indeed begins, Cake. Okay, so... Okay, so I can still punch. Can I still choke lads out? How do I choke lads out again? Uh... uh. Flippy dip. And the reason why glitchy is because this is the beginning of Act 3. Why is the ground like that? Nobody. Raiden, turn the game console off right now. What no! The, mission the fourth is wall is broken! Tower right now. I it's will not! You. Don't worry, it's a game. It's a game just like usual. You'll ruin your eyes playing so close to the TV. I'm not what on the TV, I'm about? using an emulator. Raiden, something happened to me last Thursday when I was driving home. I had a couple of miles to go. I looked up and saw a glowing orange object in the sky. That's the called the sun! It was moving very irregularly. Suddenly, uh, a UFO. there was intense light all around me, and when I came to, I was home. What do you think happened to me? You were abducted huh? by Fine. the aliens, and also the patriots, who are aliens. Eh. Honestly, though, you have played the game for I a long time. I just began! Don't you have anything else to do with your time? No, this is literally my profession! Oh, hello. What's that? It, it's a naked bishi. Eh? <laughs> well, well then, box, box it, uh, box it, uh, cardboard box to transport game software. The eye is designed. The eye design is eye catching. Huh. Oh, that's a. That, 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 I did not notice that. I'm just a box! Hello! Infiltrate the enemy fortress uh. outer heaven. Destroy That's the wrong game. The final weapon, metal gear. Okay. Out. Oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no. Oh no, oh no, medicine! Is that, is that like rations? Gold medicine, press. Why would I need gold medicine? Dead. Uh, what? What? What did that just do to me? Oh no. Where am I supposed to go? I mean, I have the box. Silence. Honestly, though. Hush. Hush your face. Oh, I need the box again. They're going to be calling you every few minutes. Oh, I have. I, uh... Like, ow. Click, 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 click. Click, 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 click. That's not where the box is. Clip. How did that lad downstairs not see me? Oh well. Stop breaking the fourth wall, Uncle Max from the Oh yeah, it is the same voice actor. Right, you said that a while ago, Glitchy, and I forgot. Yes, that is Uncle Max. Hello? Is nothing. What's that? Is nothing. Even my patience has its limits. I just can't leave this thing up to you any longer. You hush. I'll do the fighting. You can just go home. This is not a job for plumbers, Uncle Max. So if I get caught in this area, I'm just set what? Well, I did a ninja kick. Well, 
Welcome to Kojima's Wild Ride. Posture check, posture check, posture check, posture check, posture check, posture check. <laughs> uh, oh, that's a pretty illustration. That's a mythological illustration, isn't it? It's turtles all the way down. Or I suppose in this case, snakes. Hayden, I need you to find out the secrets of the Omnitrix. <laughs> Imagine if... I, I wonder why different characters getting the Omnitrix isn't a more common AU. I kind of feel like that should be like... Like that was a lot of people's childhoods. At least in the West. What? 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 There's sci-fi flipping! But get up, Raiden! Get up! Get up! Gotta get! Yes! No! Ah, oh, that's where I'm supposed to go. Hello! Don't mind me! Oh, that was not a way I could go. That, that's just the void. <laughs> no. Okay, I know where I'm supposed to go now. Jack, please answer me. Jack! So I get the box, and then I just go that way. Okay. Hush. Hush. Silence. Shush. 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 Okay, I think I, I think I know exactly how I need to go about this. Riding, riding. Oh, can I not? Okay, I just can't jump off there. Okay. Nope. Riding sounds like it. Does he? I mean, I guess. Not real, man. I am just box. That's why I it, just believe me when I say I am just box. Medicine. No, oh, Raiden, get up. I tried to flip through him. Go! Ah! No! No! Jack, okay. Please answer me, Jack. Ha hand him the ox cord. <laughs> no, I will not hand. I will not hand him the ox cord. He is only playing trash. Yeah, we only listen to high art. Standing here, I realize. That is what high art music is. <laughs> okay, and um, books. <laughs> Great, now I have that song stuck in my head again. <laughs> But who's to judge? <laughs> you look so goofy going down the stairs in the box. No. Who's there? Nothing. No one. Nothing. I am only box. Mm -hmm. I am only box. There. No, there is not. I am only box. It is illegal to say otherwise. So sayeth I. <laughs> Even my 
You hush. I now have medicine. <laughs> okay. Hoi. <laughs> it's racist to look in the box. It's against my religion for you to look in the box. Hello, Mushi. Infiltrate. The enemy fortress. I'm trying. Yes, it's against terms of services to look in the box. What's back here? The camera is telling me to go that way, so I'm going to go this way. I don't speak Japanese. Uh, Kai, thank you for the hydration. Russian! No. Bad. And energized by kick. Why is there a sleeping lady in my mini map? Variety level 13. Rescue Meryl. The return of Ginola. Skull! You, you good, lad? You, you, you seem to need a little bit of moisturizer. Hello, Kai. Actually, there is something I've been meaning to tell you, but I just couldn't. Say it. You should know, though. On Saturday morning last week, I saw a guy leaving Rosemary's room. What were you How doing by Rosemary's room? They were Why should I trust you? You're a skull face man. Sorry to bring this up during the mission, but... Silence. <laughs> Jack, it's me. That's Mary, help. Jack, I owe you an apology. If it's about that conversation just now, I'm the one who's sorry. No, it's something else. What is it? That day at Federal Hall two years ago, it wasn't a coincidence. Eh? I was ordered to keep an eye on you. Eh? Eye on me? Plot yes. twist. By the Patriots. Oh, no. You're a spy? I suppose. Yes. It's an ugly word. Are you still there? Was sleeping with me a part of the job? I fell in love with you. How could anyone? I can't excuse what I did. I've reported every detail of your personal life to them these two years. Oh, my what God. You said, everything. Oh, Most my God. But some things I didn't tell anyone. <sighs> like what I felt for you. So that's why you were involved in this mission. I should have known. Why else would they toss an analyst into the mix at the last minute? I'm sorry. I know what I did was wrong. No matter where I go, I get used. I reinvented myself to suit your tastes. Hairstyle, That's clothes, definitely not I toxic move, behavior. About. You say you love the color of my hair, my eyes. They're not even real. You must have gone over my psych profile with a fine-tooth comb. It was my job. Great performance. Had me completely fooled. What I really wanted was for you to see the real me. It hurt to play out this, this artificial romance. It was worse to lie to myself than to you. The more love you gave me, the more it hurt. Because I knew the person you loved was just a character. So it was artificial on my end too. It was just a game, not the real thing. Oh, Jack. I feel better knowing that. What? I was in love, or thought I was, with someone who didn't exist. Hello, Gray. I was trying to be someone I wasn't by loving what wasn't real. Oh, wow. I don't wow. know who you really are. The person I knew isn't real. She's not the woman I'm talking to right now. In a sense, the deception was my own. Not I am on Kojima's Jack, wild I ride. I was acting because that was my job. But I did fall in love with you. That wasn't an act. You expect me to believe that? Oh. It's okay. You had your reasons, right? Hey, I understand, but I have nothing left to... Jack! What? I'm... I'm carrying... I'm pregnant. 
What? Rose, what's going on? What? Okay, creepy robot. Amazing how you walk around like that. <laughs> Hello, snake. Snake. What are those tattoos? Apparently, <laughs> apparently, Snake is impressed. Where's my gear? Right over there. What? <laughs> I, That's more like my jaw is dropping, Kay. <laughs> pat, pat. Sorry about earlier. I had to use you as bait to gain access to Arsenal. It worked. I Why suppose didn't you it did. About Olga? You never asked. <sighs> Not happy about that? Get over it. Any effects of the virus yet? Still waiting on that. So, it was rigged by the Patriots? Looks like it. From what I can tell, Arsenal is headed for Manhattan. I don't oh, know no. what Solidus is planning, but we'll have to deal with it one way or another. There's also a troop of production model rays ahead. A troop of units. rays? 25, 25 metal 25. gears. Yeah. Can't say I've faced that many metal gears before, but I think we can deal. No way we can. We can because we have no other choice. Well, wow. I've stocked up on stinger missiles. Oh yeah, Olga left this for you. I don't know why the Manhattan Project was called the Manhattan Project, considering it was in Nevada. Oh, it's the sword! Congratulations, Raiden. This is the rest of your life now. Besides, I'm not a big fan of blades. Whoosh. But I agree, you... Have missed a lot. <laughs> stick up and down to make a vertical slice, and left and right to slice parallel to the ground. Okay. Move the stick in a circle to do a rotating cut. So we are Push doing ape escape rules. I should stream ape escape one you day. Guard with your blade if you have the ape L1 escape three. Press down. I may as well do you ape escape one to two. deflect a bullet or two. Okay. Wait, wait. Ah, I'm sorry, Snake! I'm sorry! It's no use. Oh. Wait. Can I open this door by cutting it open? No. The reason it was called the Manhattan Project was because if you, the USSR got wind of it, they would most likely... They would be most likely to look in Manhattan. Oh, okay! Uh, where do I go now? Oh! I mean, he's so... It's, eh? Eh? Oh, okay. Okay, I was... <laughs> I was supposed to use that time to practice. Come on, time to go. <laughs> If you run out of ammo, you can have mine. You got enough? Absolutely. Infinite ammo. Fourth wall break! He has the snake. infinite re uh, he has the what? infinite ammo bandana. Snake, have you ever enjoyed killing someone? What are you talking about? I'm not sure. Sometimes it's hard to tell the difference between reality and a game. Diminished sense of reality, huh? VR training will do that. No, it was field training when I was a kid. I lied, Snake. I have more field experience than I can remember. It's not VR that's doing this to me. Raiden, we don't carry guns to take people down. We're not here to help some politician either. You can say that because you're a legend, a hero. I'm Jack the Ripper, a dirty reminder of a terrible mistake. Legends don't mean a whole lot. I was just a name to exploit. Just like you. People will remember only the good part. The right part of what you did. There's no right part in murder. Not ever. 
And we're not Treats. in this to make a name for ourselves. Then what are you and Otacon fighting for? A future? You can stop being part of a mistake, starting now. What am I? What am I supposed to do? I mean, to be fair, Gray, that's not the most ludicrous thing happening in this game. Pass it on to the future. Believe in what? That's your problem. Find something you believe in, and then pass it on to the future. Ain't that the wise way of things? <coughs> Snake, riding. Hello, Atacon. You all right? Yeah. So are all the hostages. Yay! That's good news. How's everything on your end? All right for now, but there is something. What? The colonel's last transmission was strange. Strange. Strange is huh. one way to put it. Just strange. No idea. He's a no rabbit. I don't know. Where With a skull from? face. I don't know. I've never met the man actually. I, I I'm pretty sure I'll it's to around. ease the cutscene amount. If there's anything else, call me on the codec. I might be able to help. The frequency is one four one point one two. Okay, one for one point one two. Someone remember that for me because I will not be able to. Robert, is that the colonel? Probably not. Oh, sword. Sword. Thank you. Get up, Raiden! Raiden, you silly billy. It's a little bit finicky. Why is there blood mist? Thank you! Like... No... I'm, I'm shocked that nobody is mentioning that I am just stabbing these lads after trying to be pacifistic the entire game. It, don't you need health more than I do? I am assuming that there's mist because this isn't real. None of this has been real. All of this has just been a simulation and these lads just exist for cool factor. Like, which means I can murder them with impunity by the game's logic. Where am I supposed to be going? I guess upstairs. Snake, don't die! No? Oh. Die. Oh. Oh, okay. Uh. How do I heal Snake? Can I heal Snake? It is lagging. Raiden, about this colonel of yours. I found out where he is. Uh huh. Where? Inside Arsenal. Ooh. I've checked out all the possibilities, but I keep coming back to Arsenal. It isn't a relay point, it's the origin of the signal. Oh my god. And the encryption protocol it the uses is exactly in the building the is that of Arsenal's AI, the so called GW. What the hell does this mean? I think it means you've been talking to an AI. That's impossible. The Colonel probably isn't GW per se. GW was most likely stimulating cortical activity in the dormant part of your brain through signal manipulation of your own nanomachines. The kernel is, in part, your own creation, cobbled uh? together from expectations and experience. What? It's crazy, but it's probably the truth. The virus may be starting to affect GW, which would explain the kernel's behavior. It was all an illusion? 
everything I've done so far? Right. Snake, what's happening around here? I don't know. What I do know is that you're standing right here in front of me. But are you Not even real snake? Flesh and blood. Huh? It's your call. You can drop this if you want. No, I can't do that. Let's go. But I, I, uh, I gave the Watsonian argument. Oh, good. He, he, good. He heals. Raiden, they've got Rose. Well, I'm a VTuber, so I'm more real than reality. It's a trap. Help! Rose. Rosemary. But Snake, it's a trap. Since the Colonel doesn't exist, there's no way he can take Rose hostage. Yeah, you're right. I am right. Okay. But how am I even sure it's you're a real snake? Don't be weird. She's your... What if Don't I've be never weird. Really met her? What? If the Colonel is something that I partly dreamt up, then everything I remember about her could be... Don't jump to conclusions. You and Otacon are the ones that say the Colonel never existed. Raiden! Is this what Olga was talking about? So I gray the... Uh... Doyle's reason is because Kojima wanted to take us on an absolute wild ride and wanted to tease us with Snake by having this. <gasps> eh. Hello, Alyssa! What was I saying? Um. What was I saying? The Watsonian answer for it for why is because Ryan is supposed to be. Thank you for the lack, Alyssa. The reason, the, the what's only the reason for why you don't play Snake is because Raiden is meant to be a sort of thematic mirror of the player who wants to be Snake but just can't be. One ninja lads. My emulation like such is life. <laughs> there we go. You all are singing <laughs> Bohemian Rhapsody. A fitting song considering its infamous reality. I'm just a poor boy. I need no sympathy. Cause it's easy come, easy go. Little high, little low. Any way the wind blows. Snake! Snake. Kick me in the face. Oh. Oh, I know this trick. Fish and mail. You can't fool me, game. Your own iconography is your emit, con emit continent. What does that mean? Wait. Wait. I think I got that lad's arm off. No, I didn't. Stop. Really? Again? Silly game, you can't fool me. You can only... Fool yourself. Fight. Fight. Ah, oh, it's time to knock him down. But, oh, life has just begun. Thank you, I need food. Aw, oh, thank you, Mary and Gray. It's a good thing I have a nice voice considering A. I sing a lot on stream and B. I am wanting to be a voice actor. Like, like, like. 
I keep forgetting to block. Oh, there we go. Thank you, Glitchy. Oh, uh, it's the last. Hello, Fortune. That was her name. Fortune. It's been a long wait, Solid Snake. The root of all my sorrows. Point. What? Two years ago, you killed my father. That was the beginning of hell for us. Everyone I love has been taken from me one by one. And no matter how hard I try, I can't follow them. An endless nightmare. The only thing we live for is to see it end. almost over you can't be serious about firing the nuke since no one can kill me I may as well kill everyone I can there are healthier ways of coping with the loss of loved ones love Damn. looks like I'm today's pick you go on ahead oh we're not we're not going to fight fortune okay well I mean I guess we've already fought fortune. Good luck, Snake. What are you gonna do? Bullets can't get near her. I'll think of something. There's no such thing as a witch. You think you can kill me? The voice kingdom of Kagas edition. <laughs> I need to do another karaoke stream. I didn't kill your father. Someday soon. Do you think yes, Kagas is the lies. correct name. Right. Don't get worry, Mary. You got it right first try. <laughs> I mean, there are better coping mechanisms, like getting a hobby that, you know, isn't murder. Like, some may argue murder can be a hobby, but I greatly disagree. Uh, well, okay. Now we're here. Cogito. <laughs> It looks like you remember the way you used to kill in the old days. Or is it one of the S3 clan's proud achievements? What are you talking about? A very it good came question. A surprise when Ocelot discovered the S3 data from GW. Not a bad idea, though. Right. Using fire to fight fire, creating the perfect assassin to retire Solid Snake's brother. S3 stands for Solid Snake Simulation. Ah. It's a development program to artificially reproduce Solid Snake, the perfect warrior. The result is a Foxhound Commando. When Foxhound no longer exists, a simulated Solid Snake shaped by VR regimen. Sound like someone you know, Jack? Dun dun dun. I'm sorry to see you reduced to one of the Patriots puppets. But I've made use of you, and their plan, too. Solid Snake's sudden appearance, your arrival. It was obvious the Patriots were among my ranks. I had to smoke out the agent before the mission entered the final phase. You came in handy, as bait. Dun dun dun. Jack, those days during the Civil War were as real as they come. Every day was absolute. Split between life and death. You ran from it, and now you've been led back to war by something less than real. How very philosophical, Solidus. Oh, here he comes! <laughs> no more games, Jack. At least you know. There's no reason to keep you alive now. Hello. I've given you a worthy opponent at least. But now <laughs> you should die as the little Jackie boy I once knew. Oh, goes. He just skated in, God bless him.
But I don't don't do drugs, lads. Don't do drugs. Uh. So what? What do I what do I use against them? I guess. I guess I guess these things. Like, Oh no. Oh, never mind. Oh, thank god, what do I do? Oh, I didn't even need to remember it. Right. Aim for Ray's head section with a stinger missile. <coughs> ah, okay, stingers. The mass I was half right. Bush. <laughs> Going me god, it's not the correct way to shot and Godwin. Well, thank you, Lance. Crash in. Good, they respawn. Uh, can I throw a chaff grenade? Uh, uh, uh. Is the chaff grenade working? I, I mean, they're jiggling around, but they're still firing missiles. So. Okay, okay, okay then. Uh, hello, JL. Wait. Now can I throw a chaff grenade? Oh, these, they've got little hoovesies. Almost got him. That's all you wrote. Bush. So, when am I going to get... Oh. Oh, I see him in the background. Oh my god, am I going to have to fight 25 of them? I don't think I have enough missiles. Oh, I see. Oh no. Bush. Oh, it is bleeding blood.
Oh god, do I really have to fight 25 rays? Use the sword to deflect rays machine gun fire. I mean, they're not really firing machine guns at me. It's mostly just missiles. Right, respond. Right, Raiden. Am I seriously going to have to fight 25 Metal Gear rays? I don't think that actually did anything. I think it's just a way to avoid getting damaged by them. I don't think I'm supposed to be doing that if I can just avoid them. Oh. That isn't where I wanted it to shoot. Oh! 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 I got it! I got it! I got it! I got it now! I got it! I think what I'm supposed to do is I'm supposed to hit him there, and then quickly... Yes! Okay, I got it now. I know the trick. Yeah. I mean, it would be nice if... Uh... Would be nice if they stopped hitting me all at the same time, so I had the time to actually get them like that. Wait. There we go. Right in the chomper. all you wrote. Does, does the grenade launcher do any damage? I think they're too far away. Like... I'll see if they do any da- if the grenade launcher does touch the gut. Do not squish me with your big hooves. Grenade. Nope, doesn't seem like it. Such is life. Out. Well, at least that doesn't do any damage to me. Yeah. That's just rude. Nope. really going to have to fight 25 of them, aren't I? Hello? Oh, 
Well, at least I have the trick of it now. Ow. Okay, no, I think I just have to fight 25, er, uh, uh, 5, rather. Nope, nope, okay. I've got to fight all of them. I got to fight all 25 of them, okay. So, how many tries do you think this will take, lads? Oh, thank you for telling me that, Cake. Okay. Much more confident in my ability now. Wait. I say as I'm right back to dying. No! Back to it. Nothing to it but to do it. Is there anything that I can like wear? Bulletproof vest, damaging card when equipped. Okay, 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 okay. Honestly, Dark Souls was easier. A very, a very Big thing to say, Dark Souls was easier out. down. I just want the rations. Give me rations. Give me rations. Wait. Wait. Aha! Yes. Okay. Three. Okay. 
Okay, I've got the rhythm down now. I've got the rhythm down. Uno mas? I don't know what that means, Killy. I know uno means one. Does mas mean more? Another one down. Hello. Out. Cake, I thought that was supposed to be the last of them. I'm still fighting them. Okay. Is it over? Is it over yet, Cake? I'm on normal. How, how many is it on normal? Oh my god, cake. <laughs> Please tell me that's the last one. I don't think it's gonna be the last one, though. No. I see quite a few still in the background. <gasps> okay! Okay, okay, okay! Finally! <laughs> oh my god! Ah, <laughs> oh, that's what- That's the great thing about old games from, like, the PlayStation 2 era. They don't pull their punches. Seven. them off give you time to get away what about you <laughs> this is 
suicide. Your nano machines, they're transmitting your vital signs to the Patriots. If you die, my child dies. You understand? Oh. The child. I see. So that's why you sold your troops out to me. So many dead, and they all died trusting you. <sighs> Were they your comrades? No, not just comrades. Family. <laughs> I know I'm going to help, but at least my child. I applaud your attitude. If you have a death wish. Oh, here he comes, skating right in. You. See you in hell. Wrong president cake. <laughs> Oh, that's not necessary, you cheeky, cheeky bastard. You have to. Wow, that was a bit brutal, wasn't it? That was an execution. Oh, yes, I noticed that was a P90. Oh, alas. You will not die in vain, great soldier. Enjoy the show, Jack. But yeah, it was like us a lot. Okay, final boss time. Oh. Plus, it's out of control. Darn it, George Washington! What have you been up to? It's too late. Arsenal How's systems that control okay. is going haywire. It's on an emergency ascent course. Oh uh, no. Stupid machines. <laughs> oh. Okay. <laughs> Just to remind everyone, this is an ex-president of the United States, who is also a clone of a legendary soldier. Love Metal Gear. It's so sincere. <laughs> oh. John McCain moment. <laughs> I'm afraid I don't know who John McCain is. Oh. Snake, you had one job. I'm just kidding, considering, you know, she has God mode. Bring him in. Uh, not final boss moment, apparently. Save? Yes, I would like to save. But Killy, then, then why, why is he captured, Killy? 
That's the opposite of what you want to do. Okay, so... I thought we were going to see the final boss, but no. Uh, are we going to see the final boss? GW, the Arsenal AI is corrupted beyond repair. I admit that I underestimated you. <sighs> I'll squeeze the answers out of you instead, my son. Uh, 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 uh. Oh! <laughs> what do you hope to hear? You know he doesn't know anything. It's not him I want the answers from. Oh, I see. Planning to hijack Arsenal? Huh? Eh? You were going to screw me over, weren't you? Who talked? Ocelot? You don't just say yes to that accusation, Fortune. Hello, Ocelot. The first place. What? I was planning to give you Arsenal to begin with. Why the uncharacteristic generosity? <laughs> I'm no philanthropist. Arsenal is far from impregnable. It needs other Metal Gears as guards, a huge payload of warheads, and full air, sea, and land support to function efficiently against the large attack force without support. Arsenal is nothing more than a gigantic coffin. Seizing Arsenal gear was never the real objective. What was your objective then? Good question. A list of names of the Patriots. <gasps> oh my. They were planning to extend their control to digital information flow with GW and Arsenal. That means the information they want to filter out is contained in GW. Including that list of the highest 12 members of the Patriots Wiseman's Committee. And once you knew who they were, you would cross out their names one by one. While we, with our useless arsenal, drew their fire. Very good. You were using us all along. Were you any different? But your plans hit a snag with GW destroyed, hasn't it? No, there is another way. Really? But we have our own plans to carry out. We'll take the arsenal since you don't care for it anyway. The purified hydrogen bomb is ready to go. A nuclear strike won't stop them. Well, there's your answer, Cake. It will bury their power source. The mindless masses that they control. First things first. Of course. That was what you wanted. I won't stop you. Good luck. Thanks, but I have quite enough of that. <laughs> uh, it's the Russian cowboy. What exactly do you find so funny? Charades usually are humorous. I wouldn't have minded watching some more of it, but we're running a little short on time. What are you eh? talking about? Everything you've done here has been scripted. A little exercise set up by us. Oh, he's with the Patriots, any? Exercise? The S3 plan was conceived as a means to reduce soldiers on par with Solid Snake. That's what I told you. But the VR training the boy was put through is not the meat of the project. You think this little terrorist incident is your own doing, Solidus? This is the S3 training kernel. Dun dun dun! An orchestrated recreation of Shadow Moses. What? 
Dun dun dun. And the president's death. A ninja. A computer virus that mimics fox dye. Did you really think they were all a coincidence? Yes. Aim's own nanomachines were used to shut down his pacemaker. Oh. I arranged for the appearance of the ninja as well. As for the president, although Johnson realized what was going on, he played out his allotted part. As for the computer virus, it's a digital counterpart of Fox Tie. It was also designed to eliminate every scrap of information regarding the Patriots from GW. Ah. Oh. Your plan was invalidated even before execution, Solidus. Well then. Fat Man was a different story. He's one Fat of Man. A sort of examiner we hired to test the boy's progress before letting him tackle the exercise proper. We I had to see. arrange for Stillman's presence to coax the maniac into agreeing. If the boy had allowed the big shell to be destroyed, this exercise would have ended there. The project has no room for failures. What do you mean? Given the right situation, the right story, anyone can be shaped into snake. Even rookies can fight like men of experience. An instant creation of genius. Genius. And this training kernel would provide more than enough data to formulate such a program. Huh. You, dead cell, Olga. You're all nothing but pawns placed to create the perfect simulation. Well then. Solidus, you and the boy were selected because your relationship resembles the one between Snake and Big Boss. Fortune, you and the rest of Dead Cell stand in for the Foxhound squad but that Snake took it wasn't Big Shadow Boss Moses. in Shadow Moses, the it was Liquid Snake. of freaks outside of Foxhound. Well, then. <laughs> We've gone to a lot of trouble to set you up against the boy. That story about purified hydrogen bombs is just the tip of the iceberg. The project was already underway when I sunk that tanker, along with your old man two years ago. Throwing your husband in the brig was a part of it, too. You were told that the eradication of Dead Cell six months ago was an act of the Patriots. We provoked and encouraged your hatred. Uh, I know Metal and Gear Solid 1, yes, now Metal Gear Solid 2, and Revengeance. Uh, orchestrated? Except for the appearance of the real Solid Snake. I wonder now who sent for you. All our misfortune was just a part of your project? Oh. Well then. How could... You're no Lady Luck. You have nothing that we didn't give you. Ah. Oh. Uh, that was the most casual dying what? Do you know why no bullet could hit you? It wasn't magic, or some new age mumbo jumbo. Certainly wasn't your psychic talents. It was all staged by the Patriots. Staged? You were being shielded by the electromagnetic weapons technology that the Patriots developed. Ah. Uh. Your dead cell comrades loved your father and husband. We needed a pathetic wretch like you to keep them focused. You've been our puppet all along, just like Olga. Well then, no. You were hamming it up as the tragic heroine, thanks to the script that the Patriots wrote for you. 
pure self-indulgence, absorbed in your own misfortune. You couldn't get enough of the drama. I could have died whenever I wanted to. Hmm, thought I got her in the heart. Uh. It missed. Now I remember. Your heart's on the right. Ah. Mild plot twist there. Waste of metal, my dear. But your luck's run out. This is the little gizmo. There's no such thing as miracles or the supernatural. Only cutting edge technology. Are you sure about that also? <laughs> That's for Danya. Oh, there he goes. A little snack. Oh uh, my god, this game. This game. I knew about that cake. And clean up the refuse from the exercise. Just try. Swords. This entire thing is just sort of happening to Raiden, isn't it? Oh, I'm trying! Fortune! You idiot! Get the hell away from there! I told you, your luck's run out. Take your reward. It's all the payload Ray has. Oh, that's cute. They made it look like fireworks. Everybody down. How patriotic. <laughs> uh, it worked! She really is magic! Off to heaven you go, love. Off you go. Damn. <laughs> this is all just happening to Raiden.
Ah, uh, liquid. Riding's <laughs> just I wanna go home now. Yes, Killy, that's exactly it. I've been inside this arm all along, waiting for the right time to awaken. Just plural things, question mark? You were inside Ocelot? Yes, a sleeper in the arm of a Patriot spy. It was you two years ago? Exactly. I was controlling him. Snake, it was I that leaked information about Arsenal to your partner and got you out here. What? Oh my You're god. The only one that can free me. After all. I'm off to bury the Patriots for good. You know where they are? How? Why do you think I chose Ocelot as my host? But before I go, I have a family man. One snake and one big boss. Raiden just is he's just not even involved in this anymore. Time to say goodbye. Damn. Okay. <laughs> All right. Snake! Well, that's that's their problem now. The bridge seems empty. Oh, is it just going to make it under? It's just going to make it under. <laughs> How long is this cutscene? Killing Federal Hall. What are you laughing at? Do you know what day it is today? Uh, is in Rosemary's anniversary. That's right. George. 
George Washington took office as the first president of the United States of America 200 years ago today. Oh, wow. And it happened right here. Oh, wow. We were going to declare another independence. The dawn of a new nation here. The end of the Patriots' secret rule. Liberation of this country. This was where it was supposed to begin. This is where freedom could have been born. All you want is power at any cost. Jack, it's not power I want. What I wanted to take back from the Patriots are things like freedom, civil rights. That's what a lot of people who just want power say. Of this country. Like that's what a lot of those kinds of people say. Everything that's about to be wiped out by their digital censorship. Jack, listen to me. We're all born with an expiration date. No one lasts forever. Life is nothing but a grace period for turning the best of our genetic material into the next generation. The data of life is transferred from parent to child. That's how it works. But we have no heirs, no legacy. We brothers are called les enfants terribles. Clone from our father with the ability to reproduce conveniently engineered out. What is our legacy if we cannot pass the torch? Proof of our existence, a mark of some sort. When the torch is passed on from parent to child, it extends beyond DNA. Information is imparted as well. Okay. Yeah, how long is this cutscene? <laughs> by other people, by history. The Patriots are trying to protect their power, their own interests, by controlling the digital flow of information. I want my memory, my existence to remain. I mean, fair enough. The intron of history. I will be remembered as an Exxon. That will be my legacy. My I don't know what history. intron and Exxon mean. But the Patriots Anyone will deny in us chat? even that. I will triumph over the Patriots. And liberate us all. And we will become... The Sons of Liberty! Title drop! Okay, Killian. At least you will be able to enjoy the ending. Are you receiving? We're still here. Uh, How is that possible? The AI was destroyed. Only GW. Who are you? To begin with, we're not what you'd call... Skullman! Human. Over the past 200 years, a kind of consciousness formed layer by layer in the crucible of the White House. It's not unlike the way life started in the oceans four billion years ago. What? The White House was our primordial soup, what? a base of evolution. We are formless. We are the very discipline and morality that Americans invoke so often. What? How can anyone hope to eliminate us? As long as this nation... So you're not even AI. You're just... Cut the crap. A if literal world, god. Why would you take away what? individual freedoms and censor the net? <laughs> Jack. Don't As Mary is also don't you know that our plan part of your it. Interests, not ours and mine. What? Jack, listen carefully. Like a good boy. The mapping of the human genome was completed early this century. As a result, the evolutionary log of the human race lay open to us. We started with genetic engineering, and in the end, I we don't need to become a war criminal to be itself. remembered. But there are things not Very good point, Bacon. Information. What do you mean? Human memories, ideas, culture, history. Genes don't contain any record of human history. Is it something that should not be passed on? Should that information be left at the mercy of nature? We've always kept records of our lives, through words, pictures, symbols, from tablets to books. But not all the information was inherited by later generations. A small percentage of the whole was selected and processed, then passed on. Not unlike genes, really. That's what history is, Jack. But in the current digitized world, trivial information is accumulating every second, preserved in all its triteness, never fading. 
always accessible. Rumors about petty issues, misinterpretations, slander. All this junk data preserved in an unfiltered state, growing at an alarming rate. It will only slow down social progress, reduce the rate of evolution. Right. You seem to think that our plan is one of censorship. Are you telling me it's not? You're being silly. What we propose to do is not to control content, but to create context. Create context? The digital society furthers human flaws and selectively rewards <laughs> development of convenient half-truths. Just look at the strange juxtapositions of morality around you. Billions spent on new weapons in order to humanely murder other humans. Rights of criminals are given more respect than the privacy of their victims. Although there are people suffering in poverty, huge donations are made to protect endangered species. Everyone grows up being told the same thing. Be nice to other people. But beat out the competition. You're special. Believe in yourself and you will succeed. But it's obvious from the start that only a few can succeed. You exercise the right to freedom. And this uh, hello, Kayon. Thank you. Thank you. Hello. Each other from hurt. I, th I thought I changed that sound effect. I... Different interests. <laughs> continue to churn and accumulate in the sandbox of political correctness and value systems. Everyone withdraws into their oh, own small right. gated this... community, afraid of a larger forum. They stay inside their little pods. <laughs> this is a very interesting time to come in. Cesspool of society at large. The different cardinal truths neither clash nor mesh. No one is invalidated, but nobody is right. Not even natural selection can take place here. The world is being engulfed in truth. And this is the way the world ends. Not with a bang, but a whimper. We're trying to stop that from happening. It's our responsibility as rulers. Just as in genetics, unnecessary information and memory must be filtered out to stimulate the evolution of the species. And you think you're qualified to decide what's necessary and not? Absolutely. Who else could wade through the sea of garbage you people produce, retrieve valuable truths, and even interpret their meaning for later generations? That's what it means to create context. I'll decide for myself what to believe and what to pass on. But is that even your own idea? Or something Snake told you? You know, the scary thing is, they're not necessarily wrong. Like, they're not morally right, but they're not factually wrong. Does something like a self exist inside of you? That's never fun. Well, it is fun because it makes you think, but. In this era of ready made truths, self is just something used to preserve those positive emotions that you occasionally feel. Okay, that's factually incorrect is a concept you conveniently borrowed under the logic that it would endow you with some sense of strength. That's crap! Is it? Would you prefer that someone else tell you? All right, then. Explain it to him. Jack, you're simply the best. And you got there all by yourself. <sighs> oh, what happened? Do you feel lost? Why not try a bit of soul searching? So, Kayan, what were you playing? Though? I run <laughs> that although self is something that you yourself fashion, every time something goes wrong, you turn around and place the blame on something else. It's not my fault. It's not your fault. In denial, you simply resort to looking for another, more convenient truth in order to make yourself feel better. Leaving behind in an instant the so-called truth you once embraced. Should someone like that be able to decide what is true? I, Should someone like I, you nice. even have the right to decide? You've done nothing but abuse your freedom. <laughs> you don't deserve to be free. We're not the ones smothering the world. You are. The individual is supposed to be weak, but far from powerless. A single person has the potential to ruin the world. And the age of digitized communication has given even more power to the individual. <laughs> Too much this game is giving me a bit of a crisis. <laughs> Building a legacy involves figuring out what is wanted and what needs to be done for that goal. All this you used to struggle with. Now, we think for you. We are your guardians, after all. Uh, you want to control human thought? Human behavior? Of course. 
Anything can be quantified nowadays. That's what this exercise was designed to prove. <laughs> you fell in love with me just as you were meant to after all. Isn't that right, Jack? Ocelot was not told the whole truth, to say the least. <laughs> we rule an entire nation. Of what interest would a single soldier, no matter how able, be to us? The S3 plan does not stand for solid snake simulation. What it does stand for is selection for societal, societal sanity. sanity. Okay. The S3 how long is this cutscene? I'm already having a crisis. <laughs> S3 is not you, a soldier trained in the image of Solid Snake. <laughs> it is a method, a protocol that created the circumstance that made you what you are. I wanna get off Kojima's wild so ride! We're the S3, <laughs> not you. What you experienced was the final test of its effectiveness. That's crazy! You heard what President Johnson said. The Arsenal's GW system is the key to their supremacy. The objective of this exercise was to establish such a method. This, I'm pretty sure this is the last cutscene before the final you boss, yes, Bacon. As a paradigm for the exercise. <laughs> I wonder if you would have preferred a fantasy setting. <laughs> we chose that backdrop because of its extreme circumstances. It was an optimal test for S3's crisis management capacity. If the model could trigger, control, and solve this, it would be ready for any contingency. And now, we have our proof. Raiden, there are also reasons behind your selection. Solidus raised plenty of other child soldiers. Do you know why we chose you over them? Hmm. It was because you were the only one who refused to acknowledge the past. All the others remember what they were and pay for it daily. But you turn your back on everything you don't like. You do whatever you like, see only the things you like, and for yourself alone. Yes, Rose can attest to Thank that. Thank you for the plus you two refused to see me for what I was. I lied to you, but I wanted to be caught. You pretended to be understanding, to be a gentleman. You never made a conscious attempt to reach out to me. The only time you did was when I gave you no choice but to do so. I was just trying not to. What? trying not to hurt me dear the one you were trying not to hurt was yourself avoiding the truth under the guise of kindness is all that you did it occurred to you to do nothing but look out for yourself even if you claim that it was for my sake that feeling was nowhere to be seen in the end everything was for your sake i was never part of the picture <laughs> uh. exactly right so you see you're a perfect representative of the masses we need to protect this is why we chose you. You accepted the fiction we provided, obeyed our orders, and did everything you were told to. The exercise is a resounding success. Didn't I tell you that GW was still incomplete? But not anymore, thanks to you. Your persona, experiences, triumphs, and defeats are nothing but byproducts. The real objective was ensuring that we could generate and manipulate them. It's taken a lot of time and money, but it is well worth it considering the results. I think that's enough talk. It's time for the final exercise. Raiden, take Solidus down. Think again. I'm through doing what I'm told. Oh, really? Aren't you forgetting something? If you die, my child dies. The termination of vital signal from your nanomachines means the death of Olga's child. Not to mention the death of Rose. Oh, trust me, Kayon, there was a lot more talk beforehand. Does she actually exist? Of course I do, Jack. You have to believe me. Damn! It will be a fight to the death. Solidus at least wants you dead. We will collect the necessary data from this last fight. Then we'll consider the exercise closed. <laughs> so, Jack the Ripper, will it be Solidus, the Patriot's creation? For you, Solidus's creation. Our beloved monsters, enjoy yourselves. 
Okay. Jack. <laughs> my son. <laughs> my clone brothers and I are called monsters. Replicates of evil genes. More talking. <laughs> you are one of a kind. But still a monster. Shaped by a dark and secret history. <laughs> we need to decide which monstrosity will have the privilege of survival. loop your own double helix what are you even talking about anymore I... <laughs> it's time we were both free sod Other already you, what? Uh. the information is being carried by the nano machines in your cerebral cortex <laughs> and throughout the neural network they formed mm. <laughs> <laughs> of course the flock of doves Okay, I'll, 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 I'll,
Hideo Kojima really doesn't let up, does he? <laughs> okay, we can talk about that after after this fight is over because my god. Okay, okay, okay. What do you? Okay, what's your gimmick, lad? Hey, <laughs> I'm doing well, question mark, biscuit? It has felt like much too long, hasn't it? I thank you for thank you for the raid, biscuit. It is greatly appreciated. Oh, 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 hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. It's a small biscuit. There we go. What game were you playing, by the way, biscuit? Wait. Wait. What is the gimmick here? Wait. What is your gimmick? Oh, okay, I can only use the blade. Get. But hey, Biscuit, what were you playing? on my sword. Aha, uh -huh. okay. Thank you for redeeming Hydrate Killy. <sighs> okay. Digimon Cyber Sleuth. Ah. Oh. And Dead by Daylight. Oh, oh. It, it. No. Aha! Do I have rations? I did not have rations. Oh, I'm just- I'm just on fire! Okay. No! Oh, he's Spider-Man! Or, I guess, Doc Ock. Oi! No! How do I stop being on fire? Okay, so this is not going to be one and done, but I kind of have it now. Wait. Oh, Kaon has redeemed. Ara ara. Oh. Well, you killed me, so... <laughs> <sighs> me, oh my, Hideo Kojima really knows how to make an absolute trip. I <laughs> died from cringe. No. What is the hitbox on this thing? There we go. Okay, there we go.
No, don't, don't equip it right in you. Heck. Hey. No. Sword is quite finicky, I'll admit. Haha! No, oh, I'm on fire! And not in the good way. Wait. Oh, come on now, that's absolutely it. Yeah. What's wrong with you? Get a lunatic! on fire without a chance to dodge it uh, and he is buffed can I perhaps not be dead from fire yeah oh well I've, di I've died right you have to be solidus this is your last duty we're not just pawns in some simulation game you know <laughs> yes you are Nothing but mere weapons. <laughs> I am going fighter jets or tanks. What the <laughs> the old model destroyed four years ago was Rex. The new amphibious model is Ray. Both of these are the same as the code names used by the US Armed Forces to refer to Japanese warplanes during World War II. Really? The code name Raiden 2 comes from the Japanese Navy's name for one of its interceptors. So basically Raiden is a metal gear. <laughs> You know the code name the U.S. Armed Forces used for the Japanese fighter Raiden? Jack? It was Jack. Uh, Both of you are just weapons to be used and thrown away. Just weapons to be used on the battlefield. Just pawns in a game. Exactly as you say. And a weapon has no right to think for itself. Now, it's time to fulfill your purpose. Defeat Solidus. You know, I could have if you didn't interrupt me and do that. <laughs> Is that the best you can do? You oh, shut up, Colonel! Or not Colonel. Or the Colonel, as in K-E-R-N-A-L. Is that the best you can do? Okay, I'm in the rhythm now. Oh, Russian, right there. That would have been very useful earlier. Stop doing that. It's just a free attack for me. Actually, no. Keep doing it. Only do that. <laughs> that as well. No. I did not mean to do that. Rocket Power. Does anyone remember that cartoon? Does anyone else remember Rocket Power? 
How many rations do I have? I have one, including the one I just picked up. I think the game may be apologizing for the Metal Gear Ray fight right before this. Right before this, I say with an air quote. Yes, get buff. Just rude. How about you? I'm in my element with sword. Okay, bye bye, can. Well, I'm, I'm about to win. There we go. I win. I'm leaning back in my chair. And he's dead. Most likely, yes. <laughs> Dramatic slow motion. They will. It's, it's a Hideo Kojima game, lads. Monologues are just a part of it. Uh, I thought he was going to be impaled on the statue's head. <sighs> I am about to cry. <laughs> Uncharacteristically quiet game. Eh? What? People? There weren't any people here. Who am I, really? Huh? No one quite knows who or what they are. Snake. The memories you have and the role you were assigned are burdens you had to carry. It doesn't matter if they were real or not. That's never the point. There's no such thing in the world as absolute reality. Most of what they call real is actually fiction. What you think you see is only as real as your brain tells you it is. 
then what am I supposed to believe in? What am I going to leave behind when I'm through? We can tell other people about having faith. Cathedral. What we had faith in. What we found important enough to fight for. It's not whether you are right or wrong, but how much faith you were willing to have. That decides the future. The Patriots are a kind of ongoing fiction too, come to think of it. Listen, don't obsess over words so much. Find the meaning behind the words, then decide. You can find your own name. And your own future. Decide for myself? And whatever you choose will be you. I don't know if I can. I know you didn't have much in terms of choices this time. But everything you felt, thought about during this mission is yours. And what you decide to do with them is your choice. You mean start over? Yeah, a clean slate. A new name, new memories. Mm. Choose your own legacy. It's for you to decide. I guess it is. It's up to you. I guess it is. By the way, what is that? Oh, I just realized Dark that the body armor comes. Huh. That was my name on there. Like I input it at the beginning. Anyone you know? No. Never heard the name before. I'll pick my own name. And my own life. I'll find something worth passing on. taught me some good things too huh. I know we've inherited freedom from all those who fought for it we all have the freedom to spread the word even me snake what about Olga's child don't worry I'll find him count on it as long as you keep yourself alive he's safe do you know where liquid went I put a transmitter on his ray. Did he head for the Patriots? Yeah, but I have a feeling they gave Ocelot a bogus location to begin with. Hmm. Cheer up, we have a better lead. This contains the list of all the Patriots. But Ocelot took it. The one we gave you wasn't the real thing. What? Uh... This virus is coded to destroy only a specific part of GW, namely the information about the Patriot's identity. Which means that there's a parameter coded in here that defines what that information is. I get it. Analyze the code and you can probably find out where they operate. Count me in. No, you have things to do first. And people you need to talk to. Rosemary. I hit the parrot. What's wrong? Nothing. Can I ask you something? Who am I, really? I wouldn't know. But we're going to find out together, aren't we? Oh. Huh. Yeah. Uh, Ryden, uh, I. I See me for what I am, okay? I... I know. 
going to cry. Do you remember this place? Uh, <laughs> of course. This is where we first met. I remember now. <gasps> Today is the day I met you. <laughs> That's it. I think I found something to pass along to the future. What? Oh, this is nice music, at least. said all living things want their genes to live on. Are you talking about the baby? Yeah. The genes aren't the only thing you pass on. There are too many things that aren't written into our DNA. It's up to us to teach that to our children. What kind of things? About the environment, our ideas, our culture, poetry. Sorrow, joy. We'll tell them everything together. Is that a proposal? This is for your ears only. have a question for oh God what So that was Metal Gear Solid 2, Sons of Liberty, or more properly Substance, because I'm playing Substance, played Substance. What can one say? What, what can one say? It sounds like I'm- it sounds like I didn't like the game, but honestly, I kind of loved that. Like, like, so many stuff in the, in this day and age doesn't really challenge you like they used to. I don't want to be like, oh, things were better in the past, but like, like, it, like this feels like it could have been made in the modern day if you just updated the graphics. So I'm not saying like, oh, this is, this is better, this is better because it's older and all the things just challenged you more. No, I'm not saying that. I'm saying that things in this day and age don't really challenge you anymore. And that's not because it's new, that's just a sign of the times. And this challenged me as both 
a video game, and a piece of media in general. And I like that. I liked that. I, I enjoyed this game. I want it on record, I enjoyed Metal Gear Solid 2 because it made me feel things that weren't just, oh yeah, that was nice. That was a that was a fine experience. No, it was not a fine experience. It distressed me. It is giving me a crisis. And I love it for that. Because, <sighs> like, like I said during that, that monologue, the... Patriots AI? I don't even know what they were. The S3. That's what they refer to themselves as. The something for the the selection for societal sanity AI. The S3 weren't factually wrong until they decided to take a massive logical leap of obviously that means that we're the ones who have to do it in an in a cartoonishly evil way but like morally they were incorrect obviously but factually they kind of went wrong about the chaos of the internet age i think that like 20 years later we've kind of been shown that so like Like, what can we really do besides what Snake said? To just choose our own truth and follow that and spread it on. But then that itself kind of has a problem because some people's truths are absolutely barbaric. And who can really say whose is the barbaric one? What can we do but live the truth that we believe in? And hope that that's a legacy worth passing on. Is there going to be a post credit scene like in Metal Gear Solid 1 where Ocelot was like, Ah, oh, Mr. President! Which was Solidus. So now he's revealed to be working for the Patriots. He'll be like, Ah, oh, Mr. Prime Minister of Japan, who is also a super Nazi and a super villain. Skateboarding theme, right? There's a skateboarding mini game in the main menu. Only Kojima can give me a crisis and then remind me, oh, right, there's a skateboarding mini game. So, how did everyone enjoy that? I hope everyone enjoyed that. I'm just having a moment. How long are these credits? And like, the final boss wasn't even that difficult, I got it on the third try. The real final boss was the cutscene at the end. <laughs> was the penultimate cutscene that was an hour bleeding long. Honestly, I rather enjoyed it just because of how absolutely insane it was. This is just about passing on your genes. We can leave behind much more than just DNA. Through speech, music, literature, and movies, what we've seen, heard, felt, anger, joy, and sorrow. These are the things I will pass on. That's what I live for. 
We need to pass the torch and let our children read our messy and sad history by its light. We have all the magic Ducks. of the digital age to do that with. <coughs> the human race will probably come to an end sometime, and new species may rule over this planet. Scroll. It may not be forever, but we still have the responsibility to leave what traces of light we can. Building the future and keeping the past alive are one and the same thing. This is not true. Ah, yeah. Building the future and keeping the past alive are one and the same. Snake, you there? Uh, it's me. I, I finished going over that disc. Did you find the Patriots list? Of course. It contains the personal data of 12 people. There was a name on it. Snake, it was one of our biggest controllers. <gasps> What's going on around here? I don't know. Anyway, where are they? Well, we were right about them being on Manhattan, but... But what? They're already dead. <gasps> Twelve of them. <coughs> well, uh, about a hundred years ago. What? <coughs> what the hell? What? Playtime, 12 and a half hours. Saves, 13 times. Continues, 71 times. Alert mode, 69 times. Nice. <laughs> Lewd! Persons? Oh, okay. 76 baddies killed. 66 rations used. What's my final result? Elephant. <laughs> eh? Return your clear code to Konami uh, uh, Japan. Okay, well, I guess I'll be doing that. Hang on. Hang on. Uh, you know what? Let's do that right now. Okay, let's go to the chatting screen. Let's go to the chatting screen. Uh, okay. Is this even up anymore? Konami Japan. Dot com slash mgs2 sub dun 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 oh. no I don't think it's still up oh well Anything past that point. New item obtained! Digital camera! You can now use it in the tank episode! Oh wow! And I can now use it in the plant episode. Save. Sure. So that was a trip. Who are we going to raid? Look it up on YouTube. Uh, Konami Japan dot com clear code. Oh, apparently I could have uh, inputted the Konami code. What do you think you're doing? <laughs> All right then. Okay, who are we going to raid, lads? Who are we going to raid? Thank you all for um being here for this weird weird adventure. <clears throat> I suppose that next next time we be we are doing Metal Gear, we'll be doing Metal Gear Solid 3. 
we will be doing Metal Gear Solid 3 next time, and I cannot wait. Let's see, who are we going to raid now? Who are we going to raid? Who we gonna raid now? Who are we gonna raid now? Gonna let me know? Oh, she is still online, and so is Vespa. Hmm. I think one of those two. Da, na, na, na. Which one of those two, though? You'll make me a cat next time I stream? Okay. Hmm. I'm going to say Vespa, because Shiki may be finishing up by this point. Okay, yes, I chose Vespa, but not because I'm a simp. It's because... Okay. You know You know what? You know what, Keik? Just because you said it, I'm going to raid Shiki. And if it's too late to matter, then it's on you, you goof. <laughs> okay, everyone, we're going to raid Commander Shiki. She is a lovely, lovely gobbo military commander. She is a dear, dear friend of mine. Please be nice to her. Not because she's fragile, but because she deserves all the love. She is very much not fragile. <laughs> she will probably just bully you back if you're mean to her. <laughs> okay, raiding Shiki!